Hey guys, welcome back to Race Theory. Happy holidays to you and your families. We have made it to episode 10 of Heroes in the Shadows. Also, I must note that this is the final episode of 2021. So before we take a bite out of crime in this episode, let me just take a minute to let you guys hit that like button, hit the share button, and subscribe for more content in the hit series as well as other content in the future. Now that that's out of the way, let's roll the intro and chew through this week's Heroes in the Shadows. All puns are for humor purposes and no listener's ear was hurt by corny one-liners or poor deliveries in this video. Okay, so this week we go back to the year 2009 when Image Comics first gave the go-ahead for John Lehman and Rob Gilroy to create Chu. A tale of catastrophic outbreaks and one man to assert the front lines to take a bite out of crime. Chu follows Tony Chu, a Philadelphia police officer in a world where chicken was made illegal due to a bird flu outbreak that claimed the lives of millions, 23 million to be exact. And our young Sibopathic hero who was on the verge of taking down a black market chicken restaurant when he tried the chicken stew and get psychic images of the victims that were killed to make this soup. He then confronts the chef, who opts to kill himself in a you'll never take me alive, coppers, ah ha 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 kind of way. Our young hero then, brace yourself, because this is kind of a bit gross, bites the tongue off of the dead chef to get the names of his victims. Caught in the act by his fellow policemen, he is then tossed off the force. But that's not where our story ends, because he then gets the invite to join the FDC by a chief who is also a Sibopath. Mason Savoy. During their first mission together, Tony and Mason try to find out what happened to city health inspector Evan Pepper, which eventually it is discovered that the culprit for Pepper's murder is the FDC inspector himself, Mason. After confronting him, Tony gets his own ear bit off as leverage in case Tony tries to go after him. Mason then flees to go and find out what really caused the bird flu that killed so many people. On the other hand, Tony also leaves with his brother to an island called Yamapalu. And that, ladies and gents, is the origin of Chu's lead character, Tony Chu. Now, as always, if you want to know more about this character in the story, check it out for yourselves. We focus only on origin points with this series. So thank you guys for making it this deep into the video. I am and forever will be Kensuji. I'll see y'all next year with more Heroes in the Shadows. And like I said, tune in for more content because we have a lot of stuff on the way as well. And also, just thank you guys for rocking with me for this long. You know, it's been a crazy year um, trying to really dive back into this. You know, um, it wasn't more so a point of like giving up. But it was a point of where, you know, I was struggling on how to deliver the content to you guys. You know, there's a lot of kinks you got to work out when you're starting a channel. And I just wanted to try to make this content the best that I can make it for you guys, for you, for the listeners. All right. So, like I said, thank you for that. And also, um, feel free to check out the rest of the series if you're just tuning in. You know, I put it all in the playlist. So you have the Heroes in the Shadows playlist. You also have other playlists like King of Fighters 15 beta content and stuff like that. But um, you can feel free to check out anything that attracts your attention on this channel. And also let me know down below what heroes you would like to see in the future. Because like I said, you know, this was 10 episodes this year. But next year I'm planning on like quadrupling that number. You know, I'm going to try to get you guys a video every week. I know there was a gap this week, but that's because it's the holidays. You know, I wanted to give you guys just the last Monday of the year with this episode. So next year, we're going to try to do it a lot bigger, a lot better, you know, better production of the videos and everything. You might even see my face every once in a while. We'll see. But um, thank you guys. Take care.